says what democracy looks like. Tell me 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 what democracy looks like. This is what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. My chest! My chest! My chest! My chest! Not respond to him. Who else is uh, in the leadership here? Well, we have a lot of shared leaders. How are you doing, sir? I need a Mayor. spokesman or Mayor. someone that you guys want as your leader that you're going to take direction from. You? Well, I'm the peacekeeper, so okay. if people are comfortable, I'd be happy to. All right, well, you come over and talk a minute. Okay. You come are you live streaming right now? I am. Remember Chief Patterson? That's Chief Patterson. Chief Patterson. Yeah. Okay. Good to see you. All right. Ask him to, 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 to split the side. You know, yeah, can you, yeah, can you a little can bit split the side? side? Yeah, sure. Just so Thank you. Talk. For the people who do not, who want to be sure, who want, want to be sure, sure not to get arrested, not, not to get arrested, arrested, they should move over onto Court Street. They should move, move over onto on Court Street. People who are willing or prepared, people who are willing or prepared to get arrested, to get arrested, should congregate maybe right here. Congregate maybe right here. Congregate wherever they are. Oh, Vicky, what about everything? Yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> the, the tent, Should we just walk the tent, yeah. and other, do you want, are you not my, my technique? The tents and the other things yeah. are all going to be collected up by the officers 
and uh, then they'll be available for us tomorrow. Everything is being taken down, everything. including the geodome, the TP, everything. Okay. They will not take it down it. carefully. They will not destroy it. They, yeah. They will not but destroy they will it. Be taking it down. I understand. Where is Okay. I don't know. Okay, so people who want, who do not want, who want to be sure not to get arrested, should be going out over on Court Street. Okay. Thank you. Vicky, can we can we ask them a question? What are they going to do? It's not a real thing. Cold day? Yeah, no, this is all my stuff. Hey, oh, you can do that fine. Just stand over there for me, not up on my back. That's oh, fine. Sorry, I apologize. That's okay. Hey, I see you guys here every day, and I never come down. But right now, we got to do this. Just stand on the sidewalk. Just, just on the sidewalk? Yes, please. I, I can't be. No, no, not. Well, what would you want? Just on the sidewalk. I, I understand. Twice. Go ahead. I understand. Okay. okay. I know these cameras nowadays, you can probably see us trip from a customer. Get the tent. What, what? Get the tent. No, they said you're not taking the tents. No, we were just informed that they are taking the tents. You just, three of them just said that they aren't taking the tents. Tell me. Will we have an opportunity to get the tents? That'll be explaining, I think your leader there was telling you. Yeah, if I, if I chose to remove my tent from this property right now. Let me check for you. Okay. Right. If, 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 if somebody wanted to remove their personal property from this park, would they be arrested for doing so right now? Yeah, can they get their stuff out of the people who want to leave? Can they get their stuff out of the town? Does everybody just want to walk away and leave? Can you take their stuff out of the No, not everyone. But the people who want to walk away want to get their stuff out of the yeah, I think we can certainly accommodate those of you that want to remove your personal belongings and, and get them out of here. I don't see why that should be an issue. Because I know they want to go around and check. Well, let's do this, We want to make sure there's nobody in the tents that's, if you don't mind, it causes harm to us or anybody else first. And we'll make sure that everything's good. It's a peaceful world. I know you guys have been wonderful. Yeah. Um, but for our safety, we need to make sure that everything's good. We want to get some stuff out! We're still talking about that for a second. And then let me speak to my they said they'll let you do chief and find out. How much we're time we're going to give for moving here and uh, make decisions on who wants to do what? Yeah. Uh, uh, I, I prefer okay. yeah. You guys have been awesome for sure. no, I, I know you guys are just doing your job. That's all. I'm organizing. You're ready to get arrested? Oh, no, I'm legal observer. Okay. All right. Okay, we'll I'm just checking. We're just trying to establish. Yeah, what they the, had a couple the, questions. We're trying to figure okay. Out. What's the rule? Okay, here's what here's here's what's gonna happen in terms of your belongings. If you'd like to leave, you're certainly welcome to leave. We're gonna be taking everything that's in the square with us, and you're certainly welcome to come get your stuff after the fact. I mean, my tent's right there. I could just drag it across the street. I, that's all I was planning on doing. I mean, you can look at it all you want. There's nothing We're not going to have a whole lot of time to allow everybody to break down their tents and pick up the belongings that they've I was just, just planning on dragging it. It's, there's nothing. It's, How are you going to drag it to them? Right there. Okay, then you're not going to be away from here. Okay. We need everybody cleared up. We're going to completely clear out the square here. All people. Okay. Well, so there won't be a lot of time for you to break that down. No, I was planning on dragging it. I'm not going to break it down. Okay. It's on its I think what we're saying is that we're not comfortable with our personal property being stolen, and we would like an opportunity to remove it from the park. In one small tent. Okay. Everybody ready? Turn your stuff off so it doesn't get right there. Okay. I'd like to look at your yeah. I don't want to go through personal person. I just want to make sure there's a lot. After that, you guys are free to do Is it okay? I had dragged my whole thing over there. Is it okay if I grab the rest of my stuff? We're going to work with you. It's just a car. I'm not, I'm not sure, but uh, it looks like there's more of a development going on over here. It seems as if they they may let a select amount of people 
actually uh, remove their tents and personal belongings from the park. Um, I have been told that after an inspection of my tent, as long as it does not contain any weapons or alcohol or what the fuck is that a fucking tank? Okay, so they brought out a fucking tank to remove people from the park. We have at least 20 cops over here in riot gear to remove people from the park. Like this is this is what they're dealing with out here. That's a that's a it's a fucking tank. And of course they have their uh We have the news media out here. Hopefully they'll be civil enough. They, they, they seem to just want to arrest people, tear everything down, and, and leave. And so they've, they've asked that uh, everybody, everybody that's willing to be arrested to just gather in a circle, and they'll arrest them, and then they'll tear down the tents. Um... I'm not I'm not exactly sure. They got they got fucking bulldozers over here. Fucking if you guys can please please spread this channel right now. Occupy Buffalo is getting evicted right now. Please spread this channel. All right, and they're they're arresting protesters right now. We have protesters in cuffs. I hope you all understand what you're doing. I hope you understand what history is going to look at you as. Tell me what a police state looks like. This is what a police state looks like. Love you. We need some cars. We need some cars. Yeah, they are. They're, they want to grab already. I sent four of your guys. You guys see my spear fingers? I love you too. I guess they're gonna bring some uh, some squad cars around. You're videotaping, right? Yes, I'm legally observing right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just my, my it won't work. Oh. Okay. Thanks. But I guess they're uh, they're bringing around some squad cars to put everybody in with the fucking tank. Do you see the tank? They're right out of fucking tank. Is a contractor got money selling the tank? Want to say anything? Yeah. How, how many? How many? SOS out to all occupied. How many? Come to Buffalo. Protest. This is a revolution. Thank you very much. Got that list? You know, put. All right, we got protests right now. A date. Paul, we a revolution. I'm going right into the car. Can't put a date. That's all in violation. 
Are these officers? No problem. We're standing in solidarity with all the police officers. Keep going, but you gotta go across the street. You don't want to, if you don't want to get arrested, you gotta uh, I'm not. I'm not trying to get arrested. I'm just. Uh, I'm legally observing. Yeah. I'm. I'm just legally look, observing. That's all. Okay? I, I. I understand. Once you guys start coming in now, I, I'm not. I'm not breaking the law, though. I'm. 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 Right, I'm press. Right. I can. I, I have. I have the right to record what is going on. As long as you're right there, sir. That's fine. Well, I'm, I'm not interfering with any investigation that's going on right now. What's your name? Lieutenant Doyle. Doyle. Very cool. Thank you. What about uh? What about his name? Huh? I, I can't hear you. So what, we're not getting our stuff? No, we can't. It's tomorrow. Okay. They didn't even give us 15 minutes more. So we have... We have at least a dozen protesters out here with Occupy Buffalo being arrested right now. Um, the cops are in SWAT gear. They have removed everybody from the park. They're, uh, they're bringing cars around right now to, uh, to load up these criminals, apparently. Does anybody care about the Constitution anymore? Where are we? And, uh... And this, this is just ridiculous. I don't think I've seen anything like this, except for maybe a Zuccotti. I mean, we've seen how many different ways the police have dealt with different cities. This is absolutely overkill. This, this is ridiculous. I haven't been home in six years. I haven't been back to Buffalo in six years. I come home for one day and this is what I experience. Well, it's 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 more than just the tank. Do you what's what's the tank for? The tank. Why why do you guys like feel the necess the, like like a necessary to bring out a tank? I mean these are peaceful protesters. You guys are removing them from the park, and and you you guys brought out a tank. You know, you guys you guys are out here in SWAT gear. In, in what scenarios do you guys actually need a tank for? Like, what what is the tank on the budget for? Okay. Well, we got about five squad cars right here right now that uh, that they are loading protesters up into. Um, it seems as if everybody has been has been loaded up. Um, they refused to let anybody actually get into into their tents. They're refusing to answer any questions. But uh, less on the tank. What really upsets me is they have two big, like, snow plows over here and just dump trucks. And they have promised, promised to, to take care of all of our personal belongings and uh, make sure that they're not destroyed. And uh, it's, it, it's not seeming like they have any intention of actually doing that. Um, it seems like there's a lot of broken promises here in the city right now. One big dump truck. Cops are all over here just laughing. Now they got so plow. I'll try to get to the other side of the park and get a, uh, 
a clearer shot of the tank again. Yeah, no, I, I, I don't understand uh, why they actually need a tank. Um, from what I understand, Buffalo is not a city that, uh, that shows in a, an active political protest or, uh, or any form of a protest at all. And uh, for some reason, it's in the police budget to afford a tank. Um, I, I don't know exactly who that is, who that's protecting, but uh, I, I sure don't feel safe with uh with my police force uh owning a tank my name is skyler Yeah, yeah, I was just, I was just heading back over there. arrested all of the occupiers that chose to stay inside of the park. I'm not sure on the number, but it was at least a dozen of them. And uh, I'm gonna move over to the, uh, the riot cops over here and get a good shot of the tank. And then hopefully I'll be able to weasel my way back into the park. Other media outlets are in there right now. I don't see why I won't be able to get in there. at least 20 riot cops up in here not sure why they're all dressed up um, there there wasn't a very clear dispersal order given um, they were told if they wanted to stay in the park and they, they, were, they were told if they wanted to be arrested that they could be arrested and just stay there but uh, that that is the uh, Buffalo Police Force tank. Isn't that a beauty? Apparently that is what is necessary in our country right now. I'm doing alright. How about yourself? Uh, this is my staff. <laughs> yeah.
Doing all right. How about you guys? We're doing fine. The ten guys that are getting arrested, they're doing fine. You guys want to talk to the guys online? You guys are on your live streaming? I'm live streaming right now. Hey, live stream. At least you guys got a live stream going. We've been slacking a little bit. But uh, this is it. Buffalo encampment has been raided. They definitely wanted cameras away to one side. Um, they, uh, it looks like everybody went peacefully. To, ten people agreed to get arrested. Other people agreed to walk away. We do see bulldozers. See a lot of SWAT there. I think that the police has got this under control. I don't think that we are planning. I don't. I think everyone planned to be as nonviolent as peaceful as possible. And uh, I would say that this is as peaceful as possible, um, given the situation. So that's how I feel, and I'm a little saddened. But we possibly could have stayed five more weeks, but putting a date on saying when you're going to leave <laughs> was a real tough thing for some of the people in the group to swallow. We couldn't reach consensus on this agreement and we told them we could not reach consensus by midnight and that's why uh, this happened. I haven't actually filled them in on uh, on the uh, the deal. You want to explain that? Well, we've had an agreement in Occupy Buffalo that uh, a lot of people felt mixed about but wanted to uh, show the city that we had good faith and that they would be in good faith with us, so they let us stay here. Um, and it seems contrary to things that they let you stay here. But I mean, you guys want to, are not gonna, we can get our message out for a bunch of months if, if we sign a piece of paper saying we'll agree not to have like drugs in the camp and, and try to keep the exits blocked. Oh, thanks. All right, they're, 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 they're tearing up tents right now. I'm gonna move over there. Sorry about that, look at this. They got. They got the bulldozer going right in. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. But, uh... They are going to, uh... They're, they are starting to tear stuff up. What's with the bulldozers? Why are you guys bulldozing the camp? What? Why are you guys bulldozing the camp? The camp's going. They, yes, well, we have personal belongings in there. We were never told. You guys are destroying personal property. Why, why are you destroying personal property? There's no personal property being there, destroyed. There's, there's, tons the of, there's tons of personal property in there. Well, whether it's being destroyed they have a bulldozer in there running over tents. Now, I would like to know why our police force feels it's necessary to bulldoze tents. You guys are punishing the poor. That is all you are doing. They're just throwing anything and everything they possibly can out of the tents, right into the streets. They don't even have a care in the world. There's the bulldozer right there. It's got a bunch of pallets. It's dumping it right into the back of the truck right now. That, that, that was a tent! That was a tent! Why are you destroying the tents? You're destroying private property! truck over 
there. They're just grabbing tents, tossing around. People have personal belongings in there and they're just throwing it in the trash. I was promised that I'd be able to pick up my belongings tomorrow morning. Why is it all going in the trash? This right now is like viral online. Okay, I put it on, I put it on video, and then when I do it to record, it just takes a fucking picture. I don't know. It's all getting destroyed. Everything is getting destroyed. What do you mean everything? They, they are bulldozing everything and destroying it. They, they, they will. What do we have in there? My fucking computer. I am. Thank you. Why are you guys destroying the tents? Is it necessary? I was told that everything was going to be inventoried and we'd be able to pick up our property tomorrow morning. That was the promise made by you. Why is my personal property being destroyed? The, uh, the bulldozer is out of sight right now. I can't get anywhere close to it without being arrested. Um, otherwise, otherwise I would show you. But there is definitely a bulldozer in there. Yes, yes. Yes, and we were told that we would have the opportunity to retrieve any personal belongings. They are going to be destroyed by this. There. Can you guys confirm that there is a bulldozer in the park right now? There is Just a bulldozer, bulldozer in the park. Bulldozer. No, there's two there's backloaders. Two, there's two big, backloaders in there. Big backloaders that would plow uh, parking lots. Yeah. Excuse me. I told you. Anyway, we I, I she just caught the uh, time for change. She did just get here like the open there. I, I was told that we would be given an opportunity to collect our personal you belongings. Know, I didn't tell anybody that, so I can't speak for anybody else or what you were told. I, 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 I only know what I'm told to do, and what I'm told to do is, you know, the department is going to 
collect up this merchandise. There's gonna be a, a property. Is, is your idea of collecting the merchandise, bulldozing it, yes. and throwing it in the fucking trash? Hey, man. Hey, come on, hey, come on. Hey. You're, you're attempting to incite some kind of reaction out of me. It's not gonna happen. No, I have a, that's a legitimate question. I'm gonna answer your questions as best I can. There's a deputy commissioner and there's a chief. Well, can I speak to one of them? I know either one of them, so I'm just attempting to answer. Well, hold on, just to be, just to be clear, this order came directly from the mayor, right? Yes, sorry, I didn't mean I can't mean. answer any of that can stuff here, but there is somebody here who most certainly can. Of them because I need to make can I, sure I, that I, I talk ask, to them before that gets bulldozed? I will, I will most certainly have them come over here and talk can to Can I them. ask you a favorite person? Like, because I, I know that she just got here, like, these two got here, like, just tonight, and their tent is literally that one. They just can't just drag it across the street in five seconds. Not allow you to do that. Can they can't. Can I before it gets bulldozed? Because this is happening, like, right now in front of our eyes. Like, Charge here and have them come over here and speak to you. I am. Uh, Could you do that, please? Yeah. I am not the man in charge. I'm just doing can what I, I'm told. Can I talk and, uh, to them now? What I'm told is that nobody's allowed to go in there and take anything at this point. Okay. Okay. Well, can we speak to whoever's in charge then? Just do what it was. Have them come over and talk to me. Okay. Okay. Go back over on the sidewalk. Yes. Yeah. Appreciate your service, officer. If you go stand there, Kurt, you just you dump it in the fucking front, man. And then we see if we can get our stuff together. What the fuck? It's gonna be a beat as we see right now. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I apologize for the shake. It's uh, it's quite cold out tonight, and I don't have all my layers on. Bulldoze that dome or what? What? Did they tag the dome yet? Not yet, but uh, a cop was looking at the TP. If you guys look real clearly there in the back, you can see the bulldozer right now. There it is. There's the shot. That's it. This is perfect. This is fucking perfect. If you look at this. If you look at this, that is the bulldozer. That is tarps. That is tents, that is pallets, and it is all going right into the back of this truck. It is being inventoried into the back of a truck. I'll see what I can do with the names and badge numbers. <laughs> who who is the officer in charge right now? I have no idea. I don't know what they know who's in charge. I'm assuming one of these dudes that looks more clean clothes. Hello, Jack. Okay, we have one occupier being allowed. We have one occupier being allowed to return into the camp and remove the tent. They were lobbying hard to, with the police here just to get across. Quick, quick question. At what point do we answer? Wait, no. I don't really answer the question. And, and also, you know, we're talking about going to the steps of City Hall, like at sunrise, protest against the mayor and all of this. Do we have an idea of the John Washington. Uh, John Washington. Who is the uh, public information officer right now? No, no, they, have one. they don't. They don't have one. I have to. I have to ask somebody else. <laughs> she comes now. She's being allowed to drag the tent off of the property and uh, secure it safely.
Um, okay, so for a recap, um, we've had 10 Occupy Buffalo protesters arrested. Um, their eviction came tonight um, at midnight. They were told they would have to leave the park. And, uh, and uh, they decided to stay. Um, they refused the city's offer uh, to, to continue with the notice that they would have to be gone by a specific date. And, uh, and since then, 10, 10 protesters have been arrested. The, uh, the police are here with two bulldozers. They are just taking all the personal property. They're loading it into the back of dump trucks after telling us that it was going to be secured and available for pickup tomorrow. And uh, they have SWAT police here. They have a tank. They have all kinds of just random craziness going on. And one protester was just allowed back in the park to remove their personal property after arguing with the cop about how they said they would be given that opportunity. There have to be at least a hundred cops here right now. <laughs> and they're, they're not even removing anything gently. Do you guys have any more questions? Liberty Union. I understand. Okay. Can I get you? John, do you have a card? Or do you want to? You don't have a card, right? Uh, no, I don't. Can I give you my name when you just call me? Are you going to be around for a while? Uh, yeah, I, I, I plan to be here for a little bit. No, I, I mean, uh, we're on the, we're on the, email? I think we're on the good side. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, it's boots of solidarity at gmail.com. Nice. The video will be available at ustream.tv slash channel. I'm sorry, one more time. It's ustream.tv slash channel slash boots of solidarity. And that'll be available the second it's done. All right, they have uh, they have the uh, the the ACLU out here right now, and uh, they're observing everything that's going on. Um, our Twitter is uh, at Solidarity Boots. What do we got? Um, one sec. Let me find somebody who. Who has that exact information? Do you guys know exactly what the deal was? The deal? Yeah. For, um, to Our, stay here? Yes. To stay here. The deal was um, they wanted us to sign a contract saying we would stay here till the 8th of next month. And March. They, of March. And the agreement was they were supposed to give us two months. And they backed out on their first agreement that they were going to have with us and changed it to March 8th for us to get out of here. But and no one if we didn't agree apply on it. with it, we didn't agree on it, that they would be coming tonight to arrest people who wouldn't leave and tear down um, camp tonight. Okay. Gotcha. I got you. I got to get this.
available up online. Good. This is live right now. Good. South Bend, Indiana. Watch. See what happens to Occupy. If you can, if you can put it up on Facebook right now. I can probably put it up on Facebook. Yeah. Down go to Facebook Ustream and, and look at Boots of Solidarity. I will. There goes Bob's tent. They'll bleed that all the shit out of there before it happens. Yeah, Occupy Oakland watching right now. Wow. All right. I wonder if Occupy Indianapolis is gonna watch. They have about they have three large structures here. As they're tearing away all the all the private tents, they have a public media tent, the public kitchen, um, a large teepee, and then a geodesic dome. They have not started on the uh, the kitchen. They haven't started on the media tent, and they haven't started on the dome yet. But I'll be able to get uh, I'll be able to get right there for all of that. And they're just they're just they're just tossing the signs. Occupy Buffalo never destroyed private property. Who's Sasha? Right here. That's that is your, Sasha. It's your tent? That was uh, his I mean, tent in the trash. And my stuff. Uh, it was actually donated by uh, Occupy in Buffalo. Thank you very much, Occupy in Buffalo. But uh, my stuff is in there. It's all I have uh, on this earth with me. This is now all I have with me uh, in a very cold town. So th yeah. this is where I stand now. Thank you, uh, city of Buffalo, for uh, accommodating me. <laughs> yeah. I've yeah. been here a year. I've been with this Occupy since November. Again, we've had 10 protesters arrested here at Occupy Buffalo, and the cops are currently clearing out the park of all tents. They've got bulldozers. They've got at least 100 cops. There goes the, uh, the bulldozer again. Just dumping it. Thank you, thank you, everybody that is watching right now, and, uh, and 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 spread the word. Let everybody know what is going on right now. I mean, this is, this is madness. This is this is where people live, and it is being torn apart. Literally torn apart. Thank you, Global Rev, right now. Thank you. Like, this this, this needs to be out there. Free, free healthcare, free food for citizens of this city. I'm gonna need a. I'm gonna need some assistance from you guys online right now. Oh, it appears as if the tank has left. If anybody can go back to the prior footage that was shot and find the image of the tank that I got and make that viral, that would be extremely helpful. Thank you. 
Yeah, probably. Alright, I'm gonna go offline real quick, but I will be right back, okay? Considering what to do with the donate box. Hold on real quick.